One of my favorite books on sales is by a gentleman named John Lawhorn. And there's a simple quote from the book, which is, what gets measured gets improved. And that's certainly true, although it's very tricky to do. Another quote that I love is from a guy named John Wanamaker, who's the guy who invented the modern department store. He did this back in the 1870s. And he was one of the first advocates of using advertising to promote business. His quote, though, is, half of the money I spend on advertising is wasted. The problem is, I don't know which half. We've all been there. If you spent money on advertising, sometimes you just feel like you're throwing it against the wall, hoping it sticks. When I was in charge of marketing for my family's furniture business many, many years ago, I became a check writing machine. I was writing checks to radio stations, newspapers, television stations, direct mail, internet advertising, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. And I remember doing all this stuff, waiting for this flood of business to come in and just sitting there waiting. Some of it worked, but a lot of it was wasted. So I did something I should have done from the very beginning. I started going out to my customers, asking all the people in our various showrooms to start talking to customers to find out how they found us. And we actually made people key it in at the point of sale how they were discovering our business. What we learned was advertising was sometimes successful, but only in certain limited medium. But we were wasting a lot of money in areas that were not productive. We also discovered that word of mouth was really what was driving our business. So as soon as we had this data, we really changed our approach to marketing. We focused much more on word of mouth, on repeat and referred business. We didn't stop advertising, but we advertised much more wisely. So if you're not talking to your customers, if your frontline folks aren't engaging in the conversation, and you don't know how people are finding you, you want to have those dialogues. You also want to leverage technology. Your website provides rich information in terms of how people find you. If you don't have a robust way to look at your web an analytics, I recommend that you check out a service called Google Analytics. It's actually free. It's a little bit of code that your webmaster can put on every page of your website. And with that code, you're going to find out how many people are coming to your website, but more importantly, where they're coming from. So if you're out there marketing and you might tag some of your marketing pieces with little specialized URLs, you can see that folks are coming from those. It just provides you with a lot of robust information. Because if you want to make good marketing decisions, you really need to know what's driving business. So you want to have the conversation in the real world. You want to monitor the online world to see how people are getting to you. And when you do those things, you will be able to actually create a marketing campaign that is somewhat scientific. And your chances of seeing good returns are much, much higher.